This is a video showing you how to create a video walkthrough of Minecraft um, using ClipChamp. So this is ClipChamp. Um, sign in like you normally do. And then here for the title, I'm going to call this um, that's Minecraft walkthrough. All right, and then hit screen recording and then hit this little red button down here. And you can actually choose Minecraft as the thing that you want to record. So make sure that you've already opened Minecraft and you've got your session already happening in another window. Then select it in ClipChamp and hit share. Okay, so now. I am recording what's happening in my Minecraft and there are three lovely blocks that I've placed. There's my wondrous creation. It's nice. Looks like it's sunset or maybe sunrise, sunset. Okay. So then if we hit escape and stop the recording. Here's my recording. <laughs> okay, so I'll hit save. And it'll save that down the bottom of your browser. Um, as well as, there we go. We can see it here in the display. Let's see what it looks like. All right, so I'm going to split that there so that you don't hear that little bit of me talking at the beginning. So we do that by stopping this white line where you want it to be and then hit the scissors and we'll click on that first little bit and then hit delete. Okay. Move this to the left. Okay. All right, so let's see what that looks like. Cool. All right, so now I might put some a title at the beginning and I'll use the make it glow. I always like the make it glow one. I hit the plus to add it to my project, drag it to the beginning. Now remember that in ClipChamp you always click the thing you want to change and then up the top here they give you the options. Let's hit text and We'll call it Matt's Minecraft. Okay. And let's see where we want to end this. Okay, so. Oh, nice, nice text. All right, and that's the end of my prez. So I'll hit split again and delete that last little bit. And then I might add to the end some more text that this time says the end. Okay, drag this back to the beginning. Let's see what the final thing looks like. The end. Lovely. All right. So remember if you want to share that with someone or send it to your teacher you hit the export button and hit continue 
and then it'll automatically create your video and you can save it to your Google Drive or just download the video to your Chromebook and then send it on Seesaw or to whoever you like. All right, I hope this um, little tutorial on how to create walkthroughs um, in ClipChamp has been useful and I'll see you again soon.